Hello there, everyone. Keith Schweigert here from Langsports.com with your two-minute drill for Friday night's LL League Section 1 clash between McCaskey and Mannheim Township, which is going to kick off at 7 p.m. in Lancaster. Mannheim Township comes into this one with a 5-3 overall record and is 3-2 in Section 1, which puts them in a tie for third place. In the last two weeks, the Blue Streaks have lost to the two teams ranked ahead of them in the section standings, Wilson and Penn Manor, so they're pretty much out of the chase for the section title at this point. But they're still very much alive in the race for a District 3 Class Quad A playoff berth, and they need to snap, the, snap out of this losing streak if they want to stay there. The Streaks are currently tied with York for 8th place in the PowerPoint standing, which are used to determine that 16-team playoff field. They probably need at least one more win to clinch a playoff spot and two more wins to assure themselves of a first round home game in the playoffs. So these are important games for them. As for McCaskey, man, it's just been a nightmare season for the Red Tornado. They're 0-8 on the season so far and they've lost a school record 19 straight games dating back to the last game of the 2007 season. On Monday night, they squandered a late lead and fell to Cedar Crest 26-22, and that's pretty much been the story of the season for them. They've had the lead in a lot of their games, but they just can't find a way to close that deal, and their coaches and players have just got to be beside themselves with frustration at this point. And boy, it doesn't get any easier for them this week. Township comes in with one of the top running backs in the league in Brian Sorber. He's already eclipsed the 1,000-yard mark for the season and has 15 touchdowns. He's also uh, the leader for the Blue Streaks in receptions, so he's the key man in their attack. The Streaks love to run out of different formations, including that infamous Wildcat, which is getting so much attention in the NFL this year. They're a very tough offense to stop. And for McCaskey, they've struggled all year on defense, and now they got to prepare for this gimmicky Wildcat attack on a short week because they just had the game on Monday night. So things really aren't looking good for them at this point. This is a game that Mannheim Township really wants to have, while well, the Tornado is just playing for pride and playing out the string here. I think the streaks get back on the winning track Friday night, but we'll see how it turns out.